In undergrad, I was a student who would listen to lectures, take notes, make flashcards, study like crazy the night before the exam, and then take the exam and kind of forget it all. Now, with this curriculum, I organize my time a lot better. So I go to class, I can come home, and I kind of sit down and make myself do my work, and then I still allow myself time to like spend time with my husband or go and take my dog to the park. And I don't focus quite as much as memorizing every little detail because the important things are very well highlighted for you. We have a flipped classroom here, so we watch all of our lectures and do all of our textbook readings at home, and then we come into class the next day and we apply them in discussions. So we do a lot of question and answer with small groups and applying that to cases. The hands-on learning approach was very beneficial to me because I have trouble sitting in a lecture and just hearing all the material. It was easier for me to understand and apply it when we were actually doing that in class and putting it to real life examples. I read it once, I go into class, I do it or I talk about it and kind of solidifies it and then when I go back home I can review it and after that it's almost like second nature. At MSU we learn systems at a time. So for example, in the respiratory system, um, at the beginning of the class you start learning about just general anatomy. Where are the lungs located? How do the lungs look for different species? Kind of identifying them um, anatomically. And then you start to move into physiology or how the lungs work. And then from there we further build on that and learn clinical skills. When I found out about Michigan State changing their curriculum, it was a very big draw to me. It's making us a day one ready vet. Um, they're working on applying it in real life cases and using that information that you read at home or learned at home and applying that to the real world in order to make you ready to see it on day one as opposed to just sitting in a lecture learning about it. To walk into a class and jump right in is pretty challenging. So when we first interacted with animals, I had never interacted with a horse before in my entire life. Going and doing that the first couple of weeks of class, learning how to halter a horse and interact with a horse's behavior was very useful. So that in the later classes when we interacted with horses, I was less afraid. <laughs> My favorite thing about veterinary school so far has been the collaboration with my classmates. I've learned a lot of different things from a lot of different perspectives that I wouldn't have normally. Some people might say that veterinary school is very difficult, and it is, but the nice thing that we have here at MSU CVM is that there's so much support. It might be a scary transition from undergrad to professional school, but everyone here wants you to succeed.